problem with the ummah today is stagnation. If somebody has determined that the only salat they will make in the masjid is Jumu'ah prayer, then they will do this for the next foreseeable future. They have no plan to make any more. If somebody, mashallah, has the tawfiq to read one salat in the masjid, this is just an example, one example. If they have decided to make one salat in the masjid, they have no desire to make more. If a person has decided to dress in a particular way, which is not as Islamic, they have no, I, no intention whatsoever to maybe one day follow the sunnah of having a beard. They just don't have an intention in their heart. Stagnation. Yes, dua kar dena. That's the approach. No, you need to have the desire. I need to have the desire of what I want to do. That's why one great thing is every year, especially when it comes to Ramadan, make one change in our life, one improvement in our life, one enhancement in our life that we have not done before and keep to that. And the next year make one more. And the year after that make one more. And I say only one, but it's not restricted to one. As soon as you remove the stagnation and the passiveness from your life and this status quo of being unmovable, right? Even water when it remains stagnant becomes dirty. That's what the ulama mentioned, right? It's only through movement that you get somewhere. If it wasn't for movement, the pearls at the bottom of the ocean would never have been valuable. If it wasn't for movement, then the oud, the aloes wood, the beautiful perfume from the bark, which is the fungus of the tree, if it wasn't for movement, it would have remained stagnant there. It's by movement that you move, you move, that you do something you enhance. Make a movement in your deen. We're making a lot of movement in our world. Make a lot of movement in our deen. One movement a year at least. One improvement. And you will see insha'Allah that you will feel closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. It'll be a remedy of life. Part of the solution of the ummah. Everything, every individual done of this ummah has a bearing on the rest of the ummah. We take it down collectively speaking. So don't think that you're not part of the problem. Don't, I shouldn't think I'm not part of the problem. I am part of the problem. And I am also part of the solution. Let us make us, ourselves part of the solution. May Allah accept. May Allah accept. May Allah accept.